So up everybody, I'm Kathithai, and welcome back to Amnesia Rebirth. Also, I just noticed in the in between for me recording the la like the last episode and recording uh, recording this, the tendrils move. That is so ter terrifying. Also, I'm out of light, so that means fun times for me. More bones. Bone of security. I'm gonna need something really soon. Just match, match. There we go. There we go. There we go. Come on. Okay, I'm gonna stick in this area just because I need to get my sanity back up. I would rather not waste the light, but. I think my sanity's back up as much as it'll go. I'll risk the darkness more because I don't really have much of a choice. And I don't know what that noise was. I'm not sure if that was me or not. And I don't really want to find out. Come on, just... I'm assuming it wasn't just me because of the lines. Unless it was just lingering from being in the darkness. Come on, it just... Jesus. Come on, just get the freaking thing. I'm not sure which driving are so insane. Come on. More matches, good, good, good. Got stock back up. No wrong thing. Shh, shh, my love. Freaking scare me more than than the game itself sometimes. Or I mean the monsters in the game. I, you know. I go back to the safety lights. All right, now that we got our safety light back up. Come on, just to the darkness. I just want to say, I just got an achievement called Overlooked. I don't like that, because I couldn't see him, and I could feel it, like, in my body that he was there. <sighs> Everything's going on at the worst time, because the dogs- I, I have dogs, and they're, they're not- they're not wanting to relax. And the monster's here, and I can't see it, and I don't know where it is. And I don't... Come on. Okay. Okay, I think I'm in a better angle. So that's what I screwed up last time. Uh, if you watched that previous episode, I, um... Actually, I'll probably even put a clip in. There's one of those holes in here.
I'm dead. Yeah, basically what I ended up doing is I didn't hold it. That's what my problem was. I crouched, but I didn't hold crouch, which means I wasn't laying down, which means it immediately just saw me crouching in a corner, just begging for mercy. And of course, it did not have mercy. Actually, I guess it was mercy. It didn't immediately kill me. It was just like, what are you doing, you absolute fool? I'm gonna give you a chance and just chuck you across the room. I'm actually gonna throw you closer to where you need to go. Okay, I can't hear it anymore. I don't know how foolproof of a thing is. I'm assuming that if it, it spots you... That you're pretty much like... If it sees you and you crouch down, then it's not like you're not free reign. Like you... Oh my god, you... The baby, the baby, the baby. The baby, the baby, the baby. No, wrong thing. Every time, it, it's because the button's X. And I'm pushing C by accident, because it's like right beside X on the keyboard. And that's why that keeps happening. Okay, I need to just... Just need to stop being a baby about this and just go into the darkness and hope for the best. Here we go. I'm not letting that. It's a waste of a match. Crouch, crap. There it is. Pretty sure it goes like all the way around the, the little pathway it took to where it would be behind me right now, which is why I'm not. Which is why I'm. Not, okay. Time to run. Okay. Go, go, go. So it's not foolproof. It is not foolproof. I should have just gone. Baby, baby, very, very. Well, you gotta do this to mama. <sighs> okay, that's uh. <laughs> not the. Didn't go too well. And I need some freaking light. Oh, are you kidding me? Where's the way to go? Not up. Okay. I'm not lighting that. Uh. Go. Oh, we're in the darkness. Come on, just a little farther, you got this. I want something that I can light. Can opener, okay, yeah, yeah. Come on, just give me something to light, please. Something dropped. I'm hoping I'm crouched because God, it's not. Go, 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 go! Break it! I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I am going to die. I can feel it. <sighs> come on, come on, come on, get in there, get in there, get in there, go!
Well then, that uh, I guess that could have been worse. Always look on the bright side, you know. That's that's what I try to do. Man, do I try to do that all the time? Oh, I'm hoping. I'm hoping there will be this is like a moment of calm, you know. Like I, I'm, they're gonna give me a little bit of a breather, you know. Like I, I need it, God. I, God, do I need it? Uh. What? Who are you? What do you want? I don't really trust it, but I don't have a choice really, so... Oh, this is a great way to drown. She has really bad, like, breathing. Like, how how can you not hold your breath for longer than that? Like, that's not even 10 seconds. <laughs> well done, precious one. No. It's a weird looking birthday cake, though. It looks really spongy. I guess it could just be the way it's drawn. It's a good drawing style, it just, I don't know. A cake just looks weird. Thank God we're back out into the wilderness. There was laughter, wasn't there? I wasn't just hearing things. I'm not just losing my mind here. I'm just gonna- I'm gonna go with that I'm not losing my mind because that's the one that makes me feel more comfortable. A split in the river. I'm taking this one. This one looks nice. A lady. So aggressive, Jesus. She's helped us this far. Listen, take a blessing in disguise. Not in disguise, just take a blessing where you can get it. That's what I'm getting out of here. I really need to work on the way I phrase things. Sometimes I say things and it does not mean what I just want it to mean. Beautiful little oasis here. It's also a little oasis from all my freaking problems. Oh Christ, this feels good. Don't drink too much, and uh, fill up the flasks, bottles, whatever you have. What do you mean, don't drink too much? Like, listen, this is not exactly the most shallow pool in the world. I get it's not like a lake, but still, you know. 
there's not enough of you here to drink the entire freaking supply of water. You need to fill up on as much water as you can and then get a move on. Also, try and make landmarks, you know, remember stuff so that way in case you need to, you can come back here. Because there's another one of those. Let's explore the area first and probably cut off the video there. Another one of these statues. Christ Almighty! Don't go near it, Tazi. Follow hope, life. I think, I think she's trying to help us. Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! My God! It's a fucking devil. It's what it is. Okay, in the writings they were talking about, I think it was the mother that helps those in need. 4th of March, 1937. I am Tessie I survived the crash of the plane Cassandra. With me are Hank Mitchell, Yasmin Shabani, Dr. Anton Metzier, Leon de Vries, and Malik Tambura. My husband, Salim, and others are in a cave near the crash, and need help. Some have been... Richard Fairchild could not handle what we saw here. He ran. Alex Sterling has gone after him. We can't wait. We must do something that is... utter insanity. Hank Mitchell, our leader and my friend, was badly wounded by a creature in the fort. Yasmin calls it a ghoul. A flesh-eating monster from desert legends. She may be right. Hank is losing blood fast. And he will die. There is no time to get to help. There is a shrine here. To a local spirit. This will sound like madness. She appeared to us. A figure of glowing light. She spoke to us. She offered healing and to save us from the desert. And I... I agreed. She led us to an amulet hidden here in the shrine. I took it. Now there is a... a shimmering doorway in the rock. I swear it wasn't there before. If we step through, Hank might survive. He is so pale. Oh, Salim, I don't know what else to do. This is crazy. But I promise, I promise, I will return to you. I got some ideas. This is insane. I decided I'm going to start saying my ideas anyways because of the fact that it seems like every time I say that I'm not going to say it, I forget about it. And so then I'm like, the point's pretty much mute, so... I think the spirit we've been seeing is... Tassi? Tassi? Hello? Yes. Yes, I'm here, Doctor. Oh, it's so good to hear your voice. Ah. You are still... Well. Where are you? The Oasis. Oh, we were here before. What happened to us? I just read... Uh, something I wrote. There's a spirit, a, a glowing spirit. I've seen her. I will explain it all, Tati. Come to the village. We have lit a beacon in the tower. Look for the smoke. Thank you. Thank you. Doctor, you talked about my blackouts. I have these marks on my skin, and I keep losing control. You gave me a medicine. What's wrong with me? I, uh... I do not know for certain. We need diagnostic implements, reference books, civilization. Remember, Tassi, control yourself. Avoid fear. Avoid anger at all costs. I have to go. Yes, she needs me. Doctor? Doctor! Shit! He's holding something back. I can feel it. Um, I'm not sure if there's anything over in this little area over here. 
doesn't look to be. I don't know. I want to try and see. And then I'll probably cut off the video, like, by looping back around to the oasis. I just don't know which way is the right way to go. There's the smoke. So this is probably the right way to go. Okay, we're gonna go around to the back right to the oasis. Because uh of the well, you know, the the wall. The amulet. So we will leave that for the next episode. Thank you all so much for watching. If you liked the video, leave a like. If you want to see more from me, why not subscribe? And I'll see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.